Hi there, I'm Dr. Jarrett Cohen with Advanced Medical Center. Is knee replacement surgery the only option to treat your knee arthritis? Recent stats on knee arthritis is high, and it's still skyrocketing, and about 600,000 surgeries are performed every year here in the U.S. Knee replacement is just like a norm these days. Whenever I hear people talk about knee arthritis, they're always anticipating getting a knee replacement at some point in their lives without knowing what it really entails. Today I'll be answering a couple of questions about these surgeries. Like, how much you know about the surgeries already? What does the procedure entail? What are the possible side effects? And how effective is knee replacement in treating the symptoms of osteoarthritis? Before we dive in, let's talk about what knee replacement actually entails. Just like most surgeries these days, you'll be fully unconscious during the surgery. Now, your surgeon will open up the knee from the front and amputate the bone above and below the joint. They'll insert a metal prosthesis into the thigh and the lower leg bones. Now, the metal prosthesis will have a plastic surface for smooth articulation. It's not going to be a quick one. The surgery lasts for several hours, and even after the surgery, you'll have to return from time to time for a few months or even a year until you're good to go. You know, when we talk about knee replacement, a lot of people think it's only about replacing the bad part of a car. Well, it's something like that, but the side effects and outcomes say otherwise. Just back in 2008, the National Hospital Sampling System recorded over 5,000 deaths linked to knee replacement in Medicare beneficiaries. Now that's a large number, but what's really the cause? Well, there are several side effects you probably didn't know about. Knee replacement increases the risk of bleeding stomach ulcer by two to 300%. Also, the risk of heart attack will be increased by a whopping 3,100%. And another thing you'll need to know is this. After recent studies, we saw how knee replacement prosthesis shed metal and other rare particles into the surrounding tissue and bloodstream. Well, until now, we don't have a concrete report on the long-term effects that this can cause. Now, let's dive into the next question. How effective are knee replacement surgeries? You know, this procedure is widely used today, and so a lot of people must have concluded that the success rate is high. But you'll be surprised to know that there's no scientific evidence that knee replacement is really effective, and I wish there was. An Oxford University scientist, in one of his recent posts, commented that long-term data on knee replacement is limited to revision. And I believe this is so because the boys out there don't want to disclose poor outcomes and disability over time. Primarily, knee replacement was meant to be a solution for pain caused by arthritis. A lot of patients suffered from it. Now, a recent study was conducted to know the outcome and see what we have. Using a scale of one to 10, a good number of patients reported that they used to have a level two of pain but after the knee replacement, it was five. So if you're amongst the people planning to get a knee replacement to eliminate pain, the chance is low, and I think you should reconsider. Now we're not done with the reports. Another recent study shows that only about half of the patients reported significant improved function after the surgery. And if you're a heavy patient, the chance of recovery is actually the lowest. When we studied patients with severe arthritis, they had the worst outcomes after the surgery and this is a big problem because most persons opting for knee replacement have severe arthritis. After that final report, I don't think we should continue talking about knee replacement. There's a better alternative right now you should consider. It's called regenerative medicine. Now here's all you need to know about this alternative. Regenerative medicine is a same day procedure that uses regenerative procedures shown to help osteoarthritis. Do you know what stem cells do? Well, their main repair mechanism of the body, and unlike other treatments, no foreign object is employed. Internally, they've been shown to support the natural healing properties of your body. We've been doing this for a while, and we've carefully studied our patients through every stage of this procedure, and even for a long time after that, to get more data to optimize our procedures and make the best outcome, and it only gets better. Now remember we talked about the worst outcomes for heavy patients, or the ones with severe arthritis already? Well, it's a totally different result here. The severity of your arthritis, your age, your sex, even weight have little impact on the treatment outcome. Now this is a single procedure, but just in case the impact after the first one isn't remarkable, a second procedure leaves you thriving. 
Now it's incomplete if we don't talk about the side effects and risks. We've not recorded any serious complications associated with regenerative medicine, unlike what we've observed with knee replacement. And you know, the lengthy and painful rehabilitation period that follows an invasive knee replacement surgery, there's nothing of that nature after a regenerative medicine procedure. If you're considering knee replacement and want to know about other options, or if you don't want your knee replaced at all, call us at 443-524-6600 or find us at www.baltimoreadvancedmedical.com and schedule your consultation with us today. Thanks for watching and have a great day.